Hello, my name is Mordred Viking, and I'd like to welcome you to episode 3 of The Usual Suspects. This is, of course, Rimworld. In the last episode, we got a bit more of our settlement up and running. We actually have our first defensive wall. We have enough rooms. We have uh, two spare rooms, actually. We still need to build the beds there, but that is something that is coming along. We have some food production going on. In fact, we've been over farming quite considerably. Um, which is why we have a whole bunch of alpaca meat and stuff which is going to spoil. So we are working over here on actually building a proper refrigeration and kitchening zone, so it's not just all stored in here. We accidentally set a whole bunch of stuff to be cut. I mean, this is stuff that's indoors anyway, so it's going to have to be cut basically regardless, and hopefully it will speed up walk speed a little bit. But the grass doesn't really seem to affect anything. And we are collecting a whole bunch of crops. Uh, the stuff on the very rich soil has already grown. We are replacing those with heel root, which was the intended crop. So once again, we're probably not going to have any medicine, but hey, we're trying. Um, we are using Colony Manager for a lot of things, and that is also why I think we have so many um, problems with the amount of food that we have and you guys are doing stuff marvelous right so we do have this raid coming it's Aaron on his own we're just going to wait until he actually attacks us so we'll just kind of sit back and let things be produced he's just currently wandering around I don't think he's actually moving is he moving to engage doesn't look like it the Valnoma cannot get too close Valnoma is hunting You're hunting that, but... Oh, right, that's already been picked up and butchered. Cool. Yeah, once again, we have way too much meat. Colony manager. Seriously? Hunting. Set for 250. No. Set for 100. Manage. Oh, that's creating a separate one. Alright. Delete that one. That one. Set for 100. Right, now I've clicked away. I'm just going to double check that it's actually stuck. It has. Good. Foraging. We turned off foraging because we've got crops coming in. That's fine. Right, where's Aaron? I need to keep an eye on him. So apparently we had hunting set to like 500, which is why we're just completely wasting a whole bunch of materials. And for some reason the manager thing does not refuel these stations. And that is infuriating, although we are currently out of wood. Uh, I thought we had a manager thing set up for woodcutting. We do. See, this is something we do actually need. And I would like 300 of that, please. Like, now. No, oh, they've gone there as well. Whoops. Wakey wakey chaps and chapesses. Let's have you move over. Oh, hello. Oh, that's cool. This is the, um, Achtung. Thing, so you can actually spread people out and get them in position. I want you over here. And I want to slow down so I can actually see what on earth is happening. Yeah, don't be walking in front of people with guns. Uh, let's have you guys kind of standing up. Actually, no. Let's have you back here. is my main fighter so he's going to stand there ready to attack and there we go we win huzzah that was easy uh let's see if you're any good you are pretty good at animals you're good at shooting you're good at artistic you're incapable of dumb labor skilled labor or hauling and you're neurotic i don't like neurotic but the very fact that you can just shoot is quite nice Incapable of dumb, skilled, and hauling. You basically can't do anything useful. So no, we're just going to let you die. So feel free to strip and loot. Marvellous!
Why are we cutting all these? That seems a little bit silly. Cancel these jobs. These are not fields. Like the stuff that's actually on a field. Fair enough. But those aren't. We are trying to grow cotton over here. Trani is still cutting down those. Well, no more. Oh, there we go. Cutting wood. Marvellous. Alright, let's just get on with things. Do we have some wood supply? We do now. Can we please restock these? For goodness sake. Right, next person that comes in with wood is restocking. Right, everyone's gone to bed. I need the wood to get the food going, people. Oi! Is there a way I can prioritise these? Forestry. Yes, there is. Or at least I'm going to assume that's a priority thing? Yes, it is. Alright, cool. I like that. You're butchering that. Okay. You're staring at stars and things. Do we have any food? We do actually have food. You are mining. That's good. Can we please have people going out woodcutting? Yes? No? Maybe? Possibly? No? No woodcutting? People? Are we going to woodcut? What are you actually doing? Doing essential colony management at Wooden Basic Manager Desk. Digging. Cutting, going for a walk, cutting, researching. That's all these freaking grass cutting jobs. I guess once they're done, they're done, but still. Probably have cut wood. No, seriously, this. Oh, right, you have some. Refuel that. And then refuel that. Yes! Now, cooks. Can we get you cooking, please? Pretty please. With a cherry on top. Gorilla, you are one of the cooks. Go forth and... Cook. In fact, is there no bill on here? Ah, there's no bills here. We want fine meals, and then we want pemmican. We want... Till we have ten. And we want to do that forever. There we go. Okay, much better. Most of the cutting jobs are done. Hopefully it like speeds them up or something. I, I have no idea. Does it reduce the beauty? What does it do? Not technically. No, that's not it. Is this the one that tells me? Right, so bushes decrease beauty by 10, grass decreases it by nothing. Oh no, those are blood splatters. So yeah, it's completely pointless grass cutting. I'm going to cancel all the grass cutting uh, orders. Cancel that. Just, just stop. At least the outdoor stuff. With the exception of that bush, because that does actually slow you down. As just that, 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 and that. Right. Good, he's dead. Strip him. And we are going to build some graves. We're going to put the graves somewhere out of the way. Here. Well, apparently, we want them out of the way but not too far away, because I do like to go and visit them. I could put the graves like over here. I'll do that. Just dig. One more set. Alright, and all of you really don't care about the quality. Alright, good. And this has almost been completed. Who's the miners? Tuna. Can we go and mine this last... 
slate wall. Huh. I've not had any ancient disastery things coming up, so hopefully it's okay to deconstruct that. Seemed to be that it was. How can I select the floor? I oh, know it's in here, isn't it? Floor. Remove floor. That. Then all of these. These. Remove. Then. We can sort out the walls later. I want door, 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 door. And this area is storage. Orders. Actually, let's tell you to floor, wooden floor, because smoothing just feels like cheating. Wooden floor that, wooden floor all of that. Zone, stockpile zone, in here. This stockpile zone. If I can select it, thank you. Here's clear all, only for food. Only for non-human corpses and non-mechanized corpses. Cool. And then once that's done, in fact, I can select this one. Whoops, storage. No foods, no animal corpses, and that I think will do. Don't allow rotten. Definitely don't allow rotten. Oh, and this one should be a higher priority. Slightly. Preferred. Cool. Onwards. How long do these actually last? Oh, more than a season. Huh, okay, it's good to know. We do need to get them indoors though. Gorillas on a fire... oh, whoa. Someone should go and put... no, guys. Put out the fires. <laughs> Damn it, gorilla. Oh, fight fire. Fight fire. <laughs> At least Bussy went outside to do this. Alright, back to normal. Good. There is a major break risk, no one. Right. Hopefully we can get more of the jobs done. Heal roots all Growing, cotton's all growing, those are all growing. Alright, cool. And are we getting any wood supplies? Oh, trees being marked for cutting? We have wood outside. We have way too much meat, still. Yeah, that might be because the task manager selected animals and then didn't deselect them when I reduced the amount of meat I needed. That could well be the problem. Actually, you not set the chunks. There you are. Eclipse is over. In fact, I only want this for chunks, not corpses. Right, cook is cooking. Cooks are both cooking. Good. We are building a surplus now. We don't have any fine meals. Why am I getting the fine meals I need? Trying, are you making fine meals? You are. From time to time. Oh, it's because you're having to go into there to grab that. Yeah, that's a problem. Tuna, can you come and... Devil strands completed. Marvellous. Next up, stone cutting for sure. Who's the other miner? Loads of people. I'm just going to go through and click on people until... Hang on. Oh, it's because those aren't deconstructed. This is potentially very dangerous. We'll see. Yeah, a whole load of meat just rotted away.
This doesn't seem to have horribly backfired. Right, it was just a random wall of slate. Okay, cool. And now we're back to mining. Boom. That's what was lacking for some reason. Seriously, why are we not cutting trees? This is really beginning to aggravate me. Hauling wood, harvesting tree. Target 300, zero in storage, 160 expected from current designations. Okay, so it is happening. We do have some of these done now. Um, I would like some cleaning done. Gorilla, you're busy. Valinoma, you are less so. Tuna, busy. Mitrani, less so. Bussy, less so. Mordred, less so. Okay. Let's get this area cleaned up because it is reducing the beauty. Let's have a quick look through the needs. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. You're fine. I'm actually handling the needs, okay, guys? Yay! So once again, we have no wood to resupply that. This lack of wood is really beginning to annoy me. Um, I'm just going to chop wood. All of this, all of these, just, just cut it down. Chop, chop. That wasn't a chop. Chop, 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 chop. Cool. And because we have a lot of grass, or not grass cutters, um, cutters, that should happen relatively quickly. That eclipse ended. Right, we need joy. I totally neglected that. I'm so sorry, guys. Uh, let's do a joy thing there. No, can't do it there. Can do it here, though. Uh, tuna. Prioritise building the joysticks. What's that? Sandstone. How have I got a sandstone wall here? Find that out. Has this been completed yet? No, not quite. Come on, miners, let's go, let's go, let's go. There we go, now people are playing with that. Good. This stuff is being moved. We are still doing a bit of hunting because we are actually out of food. You are still cooking. Marvellous. How are we doing on the pemmican? 320. I want more. Yeah, whenever we get food it comes in and contributes to the floors. So once the floors are all done, we should be golden. But it is taking some time. I think having so many crops hasn't helped matters. Okay, we are actually cutting down trees now. And generally just not having the wood has really not helped. Right, Tuna, can we please prioritise refuelling these damn things? No, don't, no, stop. <laughs> don't eat the hair meat. <laughs> yeah, proper food you can have. Did that actually reduce? No. Right, we do need a table. Um, that is very true. We could probably build like a common room in here. just like dig out this section. I don't think it needs to be a separate room, does it? Could literally just put a table and some chairs in like a side corridor here. Low food. What are we working on? It's fine. Um let's get my planner out actually. So if we were theoretically to build a food room, where would we do it and how? I mean we could just do like a room like this and it would then be kind of a hub to other stuff coming out the sides. But I don't like that because it's moving people away from where the work is. At the moment. I 
kind of like just a food room in here. You know what, I'm just going to build a small kind of shelter thing. Like that. And then this is going to be like the common room type thing. So we could have like a chess table on the side, we could have the food stuff on one side. In fact, I could mine that out and then have it extend over to here so we have a bit more space in there. I think I like that idea. We'll do this. Cancel you. We'll have another door. Yeah. Okay, cool. Bloody phone again. I just realised I hadn't actually started recording, so you've lost about. 15 seconds. I'm just saying that this is probably not going to be a permanent thing. Like, I think that we want our common room to be bigger and more grandiose and full of beauty stuff, because people will be spending a bit of time in there, and it's just kind of a mood enhancer. But this is just going to be a fairly basic structure, and while we're thinking about it, we may as well place stuff. Uh, no, let's just go for a short table. Like here. Chair. Chair. Chair, chair. 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 And then chest table. There. So this is, yeah, this, this looks alright. We'll grab all of you and we'll say minimum. Good. Good. Excellent. Right. Onwards. Cargo pods. What do we get? We have got. Cougar skin. Ooh, that could be worth a bit of money, actually. Quite a long way away, is the only downside. Unless everything's been cleaned. I think everything's been cleaned. We're just going to set hauling to high, because I want this stuff done. Okay, that wall has been knocked out, which means that we need another wall in there, like so. Cool! So the floor is ending. Off you go. Let's get these potatoes and things inside, shall we? Actually, Tuna, what are you doing? Let's prioritize her. Are we out of wood again? We are out of wood again. Orders. Chop wood. I'm just going to tell you to like cut all of this down. Just cut it all. I'm getting tired of just constantly running out and then running out for like one piece of wood. Just cut a whole bunch and let's get it into place. In fact, I don't think that's going to work as an airlock, is it? You need one space in between. Oh, maybe. No, I think you do need the one space in between. Just judging by the amount of times people are going in and out and both doors just opening. food in. And that does need to be walled off. I think we are going to run out of space in here. Which honestly is kind of a nice problem to have. Because um, it means we have lots of food. So I'm going to say that we're going to mine that out as well. And then down there we're going to shift these Oh, I can't move the stoves. Really? Oh, so that's what that mod was all about. So there is a mod which allows you to move those. So I'm going to get that, I think, for the next episode, and then we'll be able to shift those down to here, and we'll have our production far closer to the actual supply, so we're not wasting so much time going around. Because I know that is an issue right now, but it should be less so going forwards. All right, most of that has been shifted. Did we get most of the cougar skin? Kind of doubt it. No, it's still up there. Uh, 
and the woodcutting. It's stuff is happening. It is happening. Right, research. Research is the one thing that I do actually kind of want to keep happening. So you two are excused from work if you can research. There we go. Because I do want to tech up to electricity so I can get turrets as soon as possible. Okay, we have another crop coming in. How long do these last? 13 days. Um, one thing I would kind of like to do is have some of the cool boxes. Let's just have a double check how they work. Okay, we're under raid. Passive cooler. Traditional unpowered cooler that works by water evaporation will run out and self destruct after several days. Like, how cold does it get? I have a feeling it's not actually that cold. Like, it doesn't refrigerate very well. Anyway, raid. What we got? A group of pirates from Armadillo's Crag have arrived nearby. They are attacking immediately. There are three of them. Shotgun. LMG. <laughs> That's a gun for Mordred. And if you've been watching the armor series. I have a very big gun that fires big bullets. <laughs> right. Um, I'm going to give you a minute or two just to finish what you were doing. Three, two, one, draft. Right, let's actually get you into positions that are more conducive to a defensive strategy. They have guns, we do not. So I kind of want them to come into melee range. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hide inside my wall. No, come over here. Guys. No, I don't want you to clean, I want you to move. Really? Just come over here. Oh, for Pete's sake. <laughs> move, move. Really? Okay, this mod sucks. This is Achtung. Just want you to move over here. Right, I'm going to tell you all to clean. Though that's not actually what I'm telling you to do. No, literally, that is not. Move. Right, stop. Oh, for Pete's sake. Right. I just want you to move. This cleaning room thing is not that great because I have not used it once and it's actually getting in the way of movement. Right, what are these guys doing? Because what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to get Tin Tuna to go and stand by that door. I'm going to get Mordred to come and stand by that door. I'm going to get who's the next best fighter. Clearly it's Bussy. And you guys come down here. And we're just going to surprise them in melee, basically. We're just going to go, Aha! Though Mr. LMG is still a bit further back. So you guys are going to have to come out here. Oh, Tuna's the only one that's actually getting in position. Right. Let me attack him. Let me attack him. Go. You three, move here. Move, move, move. Let's go. There we go. Ow! Stop shotgunning me. Gorilla can't do violence. You're just going to shoot. You're going to go over here. Melee attack. Fire a J. There we go. Um, who's Doctor? Doctor is Valenuma. Come and save Tuna. Alright, these guys, are they any good? You are not bad for a 15 year old. Heat tolerant and in. Oh wow, you're amazing actually. Yeah, we're definitely going to rescue you. Chemical fascination, Night Owl. Do you have any issues? Not really. You're 
very good at shooting. You'd be a good shooty person. Okay. Uh, file saving there. Matrani. Right, we need to assign prisoners and prisoners because apparently that bed never got finished. Who's another constructor? Gorilla. Oh, that's going to require the bed to be finished. Um, right, Matrani, save. Sacriel, Bussy, save. Molly. They have two beds. They're both enclosed. What? Okay. And what are these? Flakes. And drugs. Alright, Val, well, are you doing doctory stuff? You are. Good. Turning to Tinjuna. Right, we are going to need another bed. Which I'm just going to stick in here for the time being. It's not going to be quality build, I just want a bed. And that can be used by Gorilla. Where is Gorilla? We're over there. Cooking fine meal. Now can you go and finish building that? If you don't mind, thank you very much. Okay. Raid successfully defeated. Tin tuna is being done. How badly were you hit? Shattered spine. Does that mean you're paralyzed? I have a feeling you might well be paralysed. We'll have to see. Molly was the one that I wanted. You have psychite addiction. So you do have an addiction, which means you will freak out. But that's alright. Who are you feeling next? Tending to Bussy. Bussy is probably mostly okay. Gunshot wound to the right arm. Go and save Molly, because Molly seems to be rather good. She's impossible to recruit though. But she's so strong. I'm gonna try and rescue you. You're gonna be here on like a long-term basis. <laughs> what about you? You're gonna be impossible. I'm just gonna execute you I think. Molly gets... does get meds. It's going to be very tough to save you. Like, what's my social person? What's it called in this? Negotiation. We have seven, which isn't that high. I mean, we could put Molly in a super impressive room and then see if we could recruit her. Otherwise, she's probably going to be worth a lot as a slave. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. If you are enjoying this series, then please do hit that like button. If you have not done so already, then please do consider subscribing as well. If you have any tips or advice for me, do let me know in the comments below. Thanks again for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.